Hmm, hello, everybody. <clears throat> Pardon me. It's been a big day and a huge week. It's Friday, so what are we, day four, really? Day five? Maybe I wrote it wrong. And here we got to today. So Bobby's tiny house got wrapped up. We got, we almost got a roof on, and uh, Chris, the, the main builder on this one, is probably going to put the roof on tomorrow by himself. He just feels better about doing that roofing situation, and it's going to take him no time at all. So that's ready to go. We've got the skylights in temporarily, uh, just for rain or whatever. Uh, let's go over and have a look. They've cut out some of the windows, but we're not going to be working on it Saturday or Sunday too much, so we'll just keep it out of the rain. Um, so we've got uh, roofing felt or just roof paper or some people use tar paper there's all kinds of stuff that you do this is the chicken wire thing you probably still can't see it but there is chicken wire there to stop the roof from sagging and then these two massive skylights this one here is operable so we'll probably run some power to that uh, she doesn't have the motor, but you can get them that if there's a little flap that comes out, senses moisture the same as uh, wiper blades, and if it rains, the thing just goes and drops down. So Bobby's is moving along pretty well. I'll come in the back door because it's a little bit uh, shorter for me to step up into. We've got her mezzanine started here. So the mezzanine on the steel frame been pre-designed and there's a slot all the way along here where this floor will continue. We're using uh, 40 mil by 140 mil so it's a 2x6, 6x2 truck deck. Truck decks maybe not a thing so, that's so common here as a term but it's TNG and it came from a mill and it's insanely strong. We'll see how the span goes. It is three meters or a little bit less. 2.5 or whatever once we're in the inside. We've got a wall going under there and then we've got a few things that are going to hold it up from bouncing but as far as a membrane goes it's not going to break it's just mitigating the bounce. The next one will come in on Saturday this is the second deck here one for mum and one for the kids the larger one for the kids. So that's where we got to on Bobby's there's a lot of prep on the outside of the building uh, just to get it wrapped. This one had even more prep, it's a different style of frame, and as I showed you guys before, we had these tie-downs, bolt-downs, strapping, and so we didn't get to wrap it today, which is fine. Um, this, is a, this is a mechanism that puts tension between our straps. But we did get the mezzanine in this one, which is beautiful. We've got uh, really small joists for the same reason. These are Lawson Cypress. And the truck deck profile is... Ooh, can you see it? Let's see. Right there. There's the tongue. There's the groove. It's all nailed across these little rafters, which will hold it together. And... The profile on the underside is the same as the TNG ceiling and the profile on the top side is an oak floor. Super nice. We got the curved rafters in, which is really nice too. And there's a close-up of the curved rafters. And that's where we got to on roses. Tomorrow we're going to have a design day. I gave them all assignments to do. Gave the students assignments to do and questionnaire, um, which will soon be available on my website. As far as getting ahead into the design portion, and then moving through the questions that you need to get your whole tiny house designed in one hit. And tomorrow we're going to do an exercise where we lay out tiny houses based on their design, and this and that. So it's not going to be a work day. Some of the crew are going to be working here. Rosa, the owner, wants to take some time doing some rafter staining and stuff just by herself and feel her home out a little bit. I guess we got the bathroom wall in as well, so as this becomes more apparent, I'll show you the layout of the house. But that is about it for today. Everyone's gone to the beach. 
and we'll be back at it on Monday as a group. I think Sunday I'm going to start doing the electrical wiring. Today was a half day. Um, I kept talking about electrical systems, we had a lot of questions about electrical theory, so we spent the whole half morning talking about electrical. But all in all it was a good day, the site's nice and clean, and now we have a weekend. Have a good weekend!